My name is Lucas Curtis um, from Hartford, Connecticut. I play the bass. Um, grew up uh, under a school artist collective, um, which I studied theory, and um, I actually started off in drums, playing drums there, and that's Jackie McLean School. And then after um, high school, I went to Berklee College of Music, which I graduated in 2005. My name is Akai Curtis. I play the piano. Uh, I've been playing in a band uh, with my brother uh, since we first started playing music. Grew up in Hartford, Connecticut. Uh, <clears throat> went to the young school at Jackie McLean Creative, which is what he's talking about, Artist Collective. And, um, after that, also moved to Boston. Uh, continued my studies at New England Conservatory, and then moved to New York after. Since I started with drums, and I played a lot of Latin percussion, um, I think that helped my bass playing a lot, just um, just knowing the fundamentals of, of rhythms and um, um, even of the live percussion stuff helped me be able to sicker pay a little bit more when I when I you know related it to jazz and related it to the bass. Um, but yeah, early influences go from uh, Dave Santoro, which was a teacher, our high school teacher um, at the Academy of Performing Arts, and um, Paul Brown, which is another great influence, uh, Jack McLean. Uh, Andy Gonzalez is a great uh, Latin Latin bassist. Um, yeah, they're influenced by so so many different musicians, so many different uh, uh, approaches, like um, through a Latin field and a, you know world field and uh, uh, yeah, just everything. Um, I grew up uh, classical music um, till about middle of high school, and I started playing jazz uh, and getting into it. Um, at the Greater Hartford Academy, the Arts Collective, and a few other programs, conservatory of music in Hartford, uh, a few other places like that. Um, <clears throat> my primary teacher, I think my first jazz teacher was Alan Palmer. And um, uh, he started me off playing Monk, Bud Powell, and uh, uh, you know, those <clears throat> great bebop players. And uh, growing up in the Arts Collective, one of the things Jackie always wanted to push on me was Bud Powell, and you know I kind of feel lucky uh, to be put in that position and be surrounded by people like Steve Davis, uh, Mary Davis, um, Alan Palmer, and a lot of those who, uh, um, <clears throat> incredible musicians. So um, we were in Hartford, I think, in a great time, like a golden age, where there were so many incredible musicians still there, and they're still there right now, actually. Um, but I never got a chance to go to Hart School of Music. Um, when I moved to Boston, I studied with Danilo Perez, and um, I did some also study with Charlie Benakis and uh, some other great uh, teachers. And then I moved to New York, and we put our band together, and now uh, you know, we're trying to do everything we can with our own music. The band that's uh, tonight and tomorrow is um, like some of our. Like heroes, we used to look up to them um, for forever <laughs> so since we started music. Um, Abraham Burton studied under uh, Jackie McLean, so ever since we were really young, we were, we were checking him out. Um, uh, but he was playing alto at the time. We have like all his records. We used to listen to him all the time. Um, uh, Brian Lynch, we met uh, when we were very young um, at a jazz camp, a uh, literal jazz camp, and. Um, and from there, we've always wanted to play with him. Uh, uh, Jaleel Shaw, which is, he's our age. <laughs> but, um, but he's another one that we, you know, when we came to New York, he was one of the first cats we would check out, you know. Um, he's an amazing uh, alto player. Uh, Gregory Hutchison, another cat that, you know, once we got to New York, we started checking him out with a bunch of different settings, different bands. So, um, yeah, we put together quite a band. Yeah. <laughs> Lucky we playing with him. Yeah.